Mara sent me three maps, uh, three full speed maps, and he wants me to take a look at them, play them a little bit myself, and then we're gonna hop on a call and he's gonna explain to me everything that I do wrong. All right, so this is a full speed map and it is not just any full speed map. I think this is one of the most prestigious full speed maps to have a world record on in Trackmania 2 Stadium. And it has been converted to um, Trackmania 2020, where we will be playing it. I know Mudda hunted this one a lot, um, so he knows everything that there is to know about this map. I don't know it that well, so give me a second to learn it. Full speed is a lot about knowing, well, once you know where to go, it's a lot about just your lines. And that's where I feel I can improve a lot. Being told what are good lines, what are bad lines, and also what are good speed slides and bad speed slides. You see this first run, although I went pretty much holding down accelerate the entire time, I lost four seconds to world record. You might wonder how I do as well. So, uh, Mara, are you ready to get started? Hello. First of all, Mara, thank Hello, you for taking chat. the time. I know it's like, what is it, 3 a.m. in Australia right now? It doesn't matter what time it is, I live in the mother time zone. All right, so you have to see me practice these math, Mara. What do you think? of the, the baseline we have. Honestly, it's a better baseline than I expected. You learn the maps reasonably fast. Okay, okay, yeah. yeah. So I've seen you hunt YOLO scrubs. I think that's why I did pretty good on that one, because I remember your 2018 streams playing that map. You were describing FS as a dance, and I cannot think of a better like rhythm map than Railgun. Is it, is it like, so when that one is played perfectly, is it just you alternate between right SD, left SD, the entire map? Yeah, it's just non-stop zigzag SDs, basically. It's so satisfying once you get all the slides. And that's why your world record is like three seconds faster than my personal yeah. best. Yeah. Well, actually, it, the, the reason it's that much faster is because I don't know if you know this, but if you drive forwards without sliding at 800 speed, you get very, very slow acceleration. Yeah. The only way you accelerate after that is if you speed slide. That's why you're losing three seconds. I don't think I ever got to 800 speed even with the speed slide. No, you got to you got to 840. Oh, okay. Yeah. Mods. Okay, yeah. uh, well, which map do you think we should start with? Oh, which map do you like the most? Which one do you want I to I felt start? like I achieved a lot better on the YOLO scruff, so I want to play that one. How many hours do you think you have on this exact map, Mara? I know it's one of the ones you play the uh, most. I, I have like 200 hours on YOLO scrubs, probably. Yeah. Something insane. It's the most fun to map in full speed. I yeah. have no doubt about that. You went for it, Div went for it, then TK also try at some point? Like, the, the record on that map is 44-41. But I, I remember like getting a, the 44.9 was super high, but like... Oh yeah, when you broke 45, speed. yeah. All right, so when you speed slide, yeah. do you do you think about your tapping rhythm at all on the keyboard? Or mm. do you just kind of like go purely by feeling? It's very much by feel. I try to look, and if I see it's visibly wrong, I, I change it, the angle. One of the most important things to learn when speed sliding, whether like... It, this is why I swapped the tapping instead of smooth steer. Okay. Uh, it, it's developing a rhythm so consistent, you don't even have to look at the speed slides anymore. You just know it's the right rhythm. Yeah, you, you can just you could just start the slide, like trigger the slide, do the rhythm, and you can just look straight ahead. Oh, so you look more and at you like your exit SD. than your, your yeah, actual tires. You just look tires. at the line where you're going. Okay, yeah. that's something that I'm wondering then. So like, you say you can enter the speed slide and just know the rhythm, even but like you're going at different speeds. And at different speeds, you want different width and tapping rhythm, yeah. right? Yep. So how do you but, how do you differentiate that? Well, at lower speeds, so like the 400 to 550 yeah. on the flat road, I usually have a slower, gradually increasing speed. But then after like 550, 600, I can just do the same rhythm over and over again, okay. and just get the same, like get good SDs every time. I see. Yeah. And this first turnover, by the way, yeah. you're entering it very early. You could probably go a bit later. Oh, I feel like I'm yeah. entering kind of late even. Like I don't make it no. to the top of the... the you'd weekend. be surprised how aggressive you can be in the turnovers and still keep speed. So like, can I go like here even? Yeah, that's that's fine. Okay. As long as you hit the... um, Like you see where the, the block connects. connects to the loop part, yeah. you want the middle of the car to hit that basically so you use that as a reference cue. point yeah and okay. the faster you are like the more vertical you want to hit the turnover the one part that i didn't understand here is after you do the turnover there's this downhill and i don't know how to get like the best speed slide 
before the next uphill again, you know? Uh, you don't need to rush the SD. You can kind of just go straight until the uh, road flattens out and then you just full turn to the right and trigger the slide. Because you, you slide- You can even S4D if you want to. You slide before the little jump, like one of these jumps, right? Yeah, but as long as you can trigger the slide consistently, that's what matters more than getting it optimal. Like the first, like you don't need to worry about sliding out of the turnover. Okay. Like just exit vertical, wait for the road to go flat, line up on the left side, and then just trigger the slide to the right. So like, we have the wall right here. This can also be very like cryptic, like do I go here, do I go a bit no, higher? No, that's a good wall, right? No, do you, do you care low. about the jump here at all? Like the small jump? Uh, yeah, ideally, you want the jump to be minimal and you want to have a smooth landing. So the car should barely move at all yeah. when you land. Because you kind of put like speed slide a little bit wider and then try to aim for this, I guess, and down. And then on the wall right exit after that, do you speed slide the entire like curve turn? If you have enough speed, you can SD the entire thing, yes. Okay. Because I feel if I try to exit into a speed slide, I, I go down too soon. Yeah, that's because you're not fast enough yet. Ah, I see. By the way, chat, for those who don't know, S4D just means using the brake, tapping the brake to start the slide. Yeah, so if you want a speed slide, you have to be above 400, uh, and then you can't really automatically start it until you're at 600. So you can tap brake to start it, and you're very slow. So I guess like what I'm wondering about is like, how do I how do I know if it's a good or bad angle for the speed I'm at? Because I know like roughly like when you're at very low speed. Uh, you have you like... seen the the sheet like the? I have seen the image. Yes. Yeah. You basically want to follow that. But is it? Like, it doesn't matter if you tap fast or slow. You just want it to be consistent at roughly that skip width. Like I can tell you right now that this SD you just did. Yeah was good, but it was slightly understeer, but it was a good SD. I need to steer more actually from that, because oh, I see yeah, I'm faster. Only a bit. That's to get it perfect, but that was good. I'm but yeah, the to most important the thing to learn <laughs> from any full speed map is to learn how to trigger all the slides. If you can trigger all the slides, at least the important ones, yeah. that's already a huge head start, because then all you have to do from there is just iron the mount. Does the, um, the skid mark with change if it's an angle turn? Uh, yes, it, imagine your speed is 40 less. Yeah, that's actually angle. good. Good visualization. And, and when you're in an yeah. uphill, is it different too? Uh, when you're on a decline, it's the other way around. So you add 40 speed. But should we try to set a target time for this? Like, what do you think is a good good target time to Something go for Something 44.5 would be a good time for you to hunt. Because okay. that means you've gotten all the SDs. That means you've gotten reasonable air time. You don't have to do them perfect. You just have to get them. And then like beyond 44.5 is like... Uh... It's just getting optimal SDs, yeah. pretty much. But those mini transitions, do not underestimate them. Those mini jumps. It really helps to optimize them. Okay, that was my sick fastest. SD. That was a really clean SD. Now, out of the first turnover, you yeah. know, don't slide out of the turnover. Exit straight, and then wait for the bottom of the hill. Oh, because I thought you could auto go into Asti there. You, you you lose more speed getting into the slide than what you get from the speed slide. If oh, you just I exit see. straight. Oh, I did the same again. <laughs> yeah, I did yeah. the same again. Okay, 44 When you're at high speeds, especially, that's good. Well done, sub 45. Yeah, just wait for the um, like exit so you don't slide and then use the bottom of the hill to slide. I see, okay. Much more consistent that way. Then I went very sharp here. Ah. Not even close. PB! Nice. Bit. Getting there. It's so, easier to correct an over slide than the under slide. But is it also faster to like, let's say you're 10% oversteer than understeer. Is that faster? A constant oversteer is faster than constant understeer, yes. Okay. So generally, if you want to miss, you want to miss on that side. You want to tap a lot more than less. Yep. 36, good speed. Oh. Not bad, not bad at all. <laughs> God bless. Nice, let's oh, go. <laughs> I completely screwed it. Still wow. too so 0.5 was the goal. Hmm. That's still, I'm still a second behind world record. How stupid is yeah, that? But okay, I want to put a bit more time into this one because I, I feel I can improve. Especially after the oh, crash. No, here we go again. Not, not four <laughs> hours, not four hours, but like, you know. This is the Grand Theft Auto meme. Ah, oh, shit, here we go again. Uh, uh, hey, hey, 10 minutes. <laughs> <laughs> Are you guys learning chat? Are you improving as well? Do you understand speed slides more? Listening to this and trying yourself? <laughs> no. <laughs> <laughs>
<laughs> yeah, but the it's best so overlap hard. you can do for speed slides, like, if you're just like learning SDs, yeah. if you just do 50% overlap at every SD, you'll be like, that's a good place to start. 50%. Okay. Yeah. I can improve here. I know I can. Copium. There's you just don't want to play rail gun, do you? <laughs> uh, maybe I'm a bit scared of the next map. I've realized about myself, Mara, I like achieving things and I I don't like not achieving things. Hey, I reckon you could improve by two seconds over. Oh, uh, maybe not two seconds, it's probably a bit much older than this, but... Like two seconds over a few days. Wait... Hey, this is good. Oh, hey, not even point five. <laughs> nice. Well done. Uh, point See, four. That was a really good run. Nice. Okay. Let's go. Uh, let's go next map. I think I'm gonna go for like a um, mid fifty one. If 51. you can get sub fifty two, that's honestly insane. I don't think I can. Looking at what you just drove, <laughs> but try. I think the main, my main goal with this, right? It's like any full two map I play to just be faster, like couple today, because those are the ones I usually play. Like that's a 52.8, so it's half a second faster than the time I had earlier. That's pretty good. Like considering you're not comfortable with the map yet, you're not comfortable with the slide. That's a pretty good time. Like the lines look okay. But yeah, like once you get comfortable with the lines, then you want to start learning the slides, and then that's when the time will snowball. 52. You think we can hit it today, yeah. or is it like way out? Well, it depends how comfortable you can get. I mean, you start to looking better. But I'm so okay. That one I know I have to go earlier. Basically, you want to basically slide into the turnover. Yeah, now I'm going wide, so that actually is going to help. There we go, that's better, right? Right? That was a lot better. That was good. That, those are really good slides. 55 speed into the wall is not that bad. Oh no, that was... could have been better. <laughs> oh, not even close. <laughs> but you got a clean turn over exit, so that's nice. Uh, yeah, the slides are not activating, coach. <laughs> Just S40, that three, that's three S40s there. Okay. <laughs> that's why you do them. Like, that's... Yeah. Okay, it's like, they're getting. But you would have gained half a second if you did three shitty S40s. I'm not even kidding. I would have gained half a second with three terrible S40s, okay. So yeah. Can I spectate yep, you again you to yeah, see sure. what you, how you, you line it up? You're sitting at 800 speed for like two seconds. Okay, that yeah. section if you don't slide. Yeah, exp explain it to me as you're going down, like your thought process. S4D, 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 right, 852 right. speed. And so you just auto slide out of that turnover too, or like the uh, yeah. tube. <laughs> yeah, pretty much. <laughs> That's one and a half seconds. That's all just slides, like the lines weren't that much different. It was just the slides. Okay, so let's... Wait, a little wider. are you s 4 d at the reset block? Uh, no. I'm just holding. Okay, I, thought, I thought you did for a second, like, wait, what? No, 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 no. I, 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 I keep the S for these to a minimum. I don't want to fail them. But that that goes along with um, triggering every slide. Like, getting comfortable with S for these, like, really help you go. Along really with important? It. Yeah. Because that's part of just triggering a slide. So if you fail it, you can but just S for it. Difficult. I don't want to. I thought this would be it's easy. Everything in Trackman is difficult. Tell me, the, tell me the secrets to uh, losing 20 pounds instead of working out, Mora, please. Hey, tell, yeah. tell me like how I can get better without any effort, please. Uh, Just get better genetics, lol, forehead. Okay, so I need to go to a lab. No, no, no. Embrace the cringe and you'll automatically be better. There okay, embrace the cringe. Push him. I don't Ooh. know if that was good. That was a good loop entry, like the turnover, reverse turnover. Just missed the slide. <laughs> Not even close. <laughs> uh, almost a 420. Almost. 52.422. Not bad. Do you, do we try more here? Or do we just accept that we're, we're garbage for now? I think I want to go next map. Play that one for a yeah, bit. Good. Yeah, good. Damn. Okay, let's go for let's go for homework. Get a get a fifty two or a sub fifty two. Should I spectate you again and see what you uh, what you would do? I think that's Why gonna not? have to be my 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 compass and full speed. Is just gonna think what would Mara do? You know, one thing I would do. What is four D? You would. Oh, do you S four D through the trackman here? Yep. Oh, that's okay. That's clean. That's clean. I can learn that because you're 800. So now you have to slide. Yep. Oh, clipped. Oof. 
Those SDs were blind at the end. I wasn't even oh. looking at skids. So again, here you did the, like the jump into wall ride thing. Can't you also reach like so you, you fully smoothly do it, or is it just not worth to do it since you're so close? Oh, you to can. Me? If you have the lineup for a go, we go. I just take whatever I get. All right, so you do. Oh, I'm oh a little faster. God. What? You said, oh my god. We're equal. Oh, I was trying to. I was trying to click your name and spectate, it was going, the names just kept changing Because so you, you said it exactly when I did my S4D, so I thought I did a perfect S4D, right? Can Where we are you going? <laughs> 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 Sorry, I only continued fast runs. Okay, I'm gonna full focus yeah, here. Yeah, what do you think is a good goal? That's right. Can I get a 49 something? Yeah, go for a 49, that'd be your first objective. Because that's one second faster than my current PB, just about. Yeah. And that's like... Okay. That's decent speed. Yeah, not bad. Not bad. Uh, I try to do the mutter. The useful lineup for that is like to be parallel with the blocks, if that makes sense. So you try to hit them dead on when you go to the decline part. Parallel with the blocks. It's hard to explain because so much of this stuff is intuitive. It's, it's very, really yeah, it's very just ingrained in you after playing, you know, full it's, speed for eight it's years. So hard. It's so hard to explain this stuff. Have you ever watched an interview with like Magnus Carlsen after a chess game? It's kind of like he's too smart, so he's, he struggles to communicate it into words with the reporter. But I mean, I'd I just love to know that. what's going on inside his head. Like in your brain, it's like, oh yeah, just do this thing. But when you try to explain it to someone, you realize, hang on, this is actually way more complex. Than it's like, so than complex, it like yeah. Yeah, <laughs> like there's so much intuition in the first, it's insane. Yeah, I'm also lacking like what would make you a uh, full speed pro. I wouldn't have well, a chance. Well, I, I already told you yeah. the secret. Embrace the cringe, just accept it. You won't reach your goal until you embrace the cringe. How do That's, I That was a good tube entry. By doing every SD as an S4D. <laughs> and not so, cringing over it. That's so bad. <laughs> You can't ask for the everything, Mura. Not every problem in life can be asked you for the. You can. You can though. You cannot. Oh, holy he... shit! That was almost a 49. That was actually a good run. I peeped by 0.6, just trying to embrace the cringe. You know what, Mura? We'll get the 49 here. But already, I think my PB on this was like 58, 50.8 on the 50 first map. 8, yeah. We improved so much, and on the second map as well. So I feel like I definitely learned something, and I'm gonna go even faster, complete my homework. But yeah, thank you for thank you for teaching me full speed. I appreciate it. No problem.